Welcome back to another edition of SoCal Sense. I'm Jeff, and I am here with the absolutely stunning Chantal. Hello. Welcome, How Chantal. Thank you so much. How is everyone? I hope everyone's doing great. Thank you for having me on here. I'm so excited. Yeah. And before we get started, Chantal is an entrepreneur, and she has her own bikini line, a sportswear line. Yes, I do. So I'll put a video right here while she talks about it real quick. Perfect. Yeah. So it's called Sancha Swim or Sancha Sport. That's the bikini line and the sports line. The website is sancha.com, S-O-N-S-H-A.com. And yeah, you can find all sort of swimwear. We have a tons of swimwear. We have tons of like leggings and like little tops. So ladies, <laughs> so ladies, for all of our ladies. For all of our ladies. We are coming out with a men's line, like hoodies and t-shirts and stuff like super soon. So yeah, cool. tap in the Awesome. Back. Yeah. And today we're going to be focusing on some perfume editions of some of the most popular men's fragrances. Yay. Um, so these have all come out within the last couple years. Um, they're the perfume concentration of the fragrances. And you're going to let us know what you think of them. Cool. I'm excited. Cool. You ready? Yes. You ready for the first one? I'm ready. All right. Let everyone know what you think of this one. Ooh, I really like this one. It's strong. It's very sexy. I yeah. love it. I love it. I don't know how. Scale of I 10. I just, 10, I would say 9 out of 10. I love it. So you would want to smell this I on a guy. I would want to smell this on a guy. All right. This is Sauvage Parfum. Sauvage. I love it. Literally 9 out of 10. Cool. Awesome. It smells strong. It's potent. I feel like it would smell really good over time too. Like I feel like it would get even stronger. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but it smells really good. Nice. I like that a lot. Cool. You ready for the next one? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me find. There we go. What do you think of this perfume concentration? Perfume. Hmm. It's very different than the it's last strong. one. Oh. I like it. It's just really like in your face. You know? <laughs> yeah. I'm like Yeah, it smells very strong. I would be like I would like give a guy a hug and I'd be like, whoo, that is so he's up on the spray. Maybe. Yeah, maybe like one. <laughs> or maybe like two. That's even a lot. But yeah, I would give it like a, like a, I would give it a six out of 10. So it's still nice. It's still nice. It's just kind of a lot. It like screams like. So a lot of people like this because it is bold like that for like going to like a club to get noticed. Or even like a, yeah, a club or even like, I would say like a concert or a yeah. festival, like it would stay on. <laughs> and this is Eros Perfume. Mm -hmm. Cool. So six out of ten. Yeah. It'll probably settle down once we get to the dry exactly, downs. Yeah. So we'll re was... we'll we'll retest everything once they settle. Yes. So. Cool. You ready for the next one? Yes. All right. Let everyone know what you think of this one. My scent is like. Oh, this one's nice. Oh, this is my favorite, I think. Okay. Yeah. Or, I mean... I so far? So far. So you like it more than I would give it the first an 11 one? out of 10. 11 out of I, 10? I would wear it. Okay. Like, I want to wear it. So this is super sexy it. to you. Yes. Like, something I would want to... Some colognes, I'm like, I want to wear it. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Well, this is Bleu de Chanel Parfum. Oh, wow. Well, it smells really, really good. I love it. Cool. I... Love it. 11 out of 10. I, I should bring out one of her guy. other favorites to see if it competes with this. Oh yeah, we should do that. <laughs> Which was Explore. She loves Explore. Mm -hmm. But I also have a Ventus Mira, so I could spray that one. Which mm -hmm. you haven't smelled, but it's very similar to Explore. Oh really? I yeah. cool. The next one she's going to smell. Alright. They're all very, pretty different from each other so far. This one smells like, <laughs> I don't want to say that because it's mean. You can say anything you want. It reminds me of baby wipes. Okay. 
I personally don't get baby wipes, but everyone <laughs> smells a little differently. It's like really yummy baby wipes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's good baby Okay, stuff. it like settled for a second and it smells more like... Hmm, not baby wipes. Not too much baby wipes. It still gives me like a baby wipe type of scent but then again i like the smell of baby wipes i don't uh -huh. know why it's not particularly like a like a cologne type of smell but yeah it's okay i think what i mean by baby wipes is like it's a fresh kind of um it's also like a clean scent like the mm -hmm. other one like a cleaner yeah it's not super strong i i don't smell it very strong i feel like it would grow over like maybe 10 minutes or something okay so yeah. we'll wait for on the dry down. So what, yeah. what would you score it on the I opening? I think I would score it at a six. Six, yeah. So you like? I like it. Cool. I like it. This Let's was see. Aqua de Jo Profumo. Ooh. Baby wipes. <laughs> <laughs> the next one she's gonna smell. Are you ready? This, there we go. Let everyone know what you think of this one. Out. Wow. <laughs> As she gets choked out. <laughs> this one is, this one's really good. I really, I like it. It was really mm -hmm. strong at first. Yeah. Oh, it's like unique. I like it. It smells different. It's mm -hmm. something I don't think I've ever smelled. Mm. I would not wear this one on myself, um, obviously. But like the other, like the, like the Chanel one, I yeah. would love for it. I would love it for so myself. So you would wear blue to Chanel, but you wouldn't wear I this I wouldn't one. wear this one, but I would love it on a guy, you know? Mm -hmm. It screams like very manly, very strong, like a big guy, like a couple tattoos. Yeah, that's what I get from it. Cool. So one to ten? I get like the bad boy vibes. Okay. The smell, you know what I'm saying? I so, And I love bad that. boys, unfortunately. So I would give it a ten out of ten. Cool. So you still like Blue de Chanel better so far. Did you get that in a while? Yeah. But yeah. you like this one a lot. I like this one a lot, but I like the Chanel one way more. Awesome. This is yep. Sauvage Elixir. So you like Sauvage Parfum. This is the Elixir version of it. They smell nothing alike. Oh, not at all. Literally nothing alike. This one's brand new. A lot of people like it. Well, I like it a lot. Yeah. yeah. I get pine get and syrup good. from it. Like pine, pine and, and syrup. syrup. Oh, you're right. Yeah. I'm sort of too now that you say that. I just like how strong it is. It literally reminds me of like a hot guy that yeah. I would consider hot. You know what I mean? Yeah, I like it. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, what every time I'm hit or miss on it. Sometimes I enjoy it, and then sometimes I'm like, this is just too much. It is, it is too much. It, I don't put this in the video, but it gives me like boy vibes, you know? It's 100% a hundred percent. Boy fragrance, one hundred percent. Like yeah. it, I would smell it, and I'll be like, mm, "You're a hell." <laughs> <laughs> I wish. I mean, can I put that in? There? That'd be funny. I mean, I don't know if you can put like. I'll bleep out the F okay. boy. <laughs> I'm totally gonna keep that in because people need to know that too. I know they do. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Bleep the things out. I'll like, bleep it. Funny. <laughs> Next we have. I'm gonna not gonna tell you what it is. So yeah, after you smell it, I can't smell what it is. I'm giving all these two sprays I don't want each. Advice, which I'm not, but regardless. And this one smells nothing like any of the others that you smell. This smells like a perf. Oh my god, this is hilarious! Wow, wait. Oh my god, throwback. Okay, when I was little, uh -huh. my mom got me a perfume for Barbies. Like you spray it on your Barbies okay. and it smelled like the beach mixed in with like coconut. I get suntan lotion vibes from that. This gives me, it takes me all the way back to that little bottle that I used to like, I and not on yeah. the Barbies, I used to spray it on myself because I loved it. Oh my God, this is so cute. It totally, you know how smells like take you back to yeah. like a certain memory or yeah, something? Memory. This just took me back to like my childhood. Oh my god, this gives me like, okay, if you're a surfer or if like, yeah, you're, I don't know, a kite surfer or any or anything like water sport, get it. <laughs> Suntan lotion all the way, yeah. beach, sand, Hawaii, I love it. I love it. It's so nice. It's really nice. I would give it a, you know, um, uh, surfers aren't like my type, I would say, but um, 
I would say this would be really nice for like a surfer guy, you know, okay. a surfer like type of like super mellow like beachy yeah. vibe, you know. I would wear it to go to the beach. I don't know. I give it like a eight. Cool. For the beach, not for anywhere else. Anywhere else, don't wear it anywhere else. <laughs> What's funny is the beach. their pitch of it was like suntan lotion leaking in a leather bag. I don't necessarily That's get the cool. leather bag. I don't know about either. But I get my Barbie scent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. Uh, eight was it eight? Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. For the beach. For the beach. Wouldn't wear or it anywhere else. Or a party. Though. Would not. Please don't wear it anywhere. And anywhere else, it's kind of. Cool. Weird. This is one million parfum. One million. One million wow. parfum. And last but not least, what do you think of this one? Ooh, this one's nice. Yeah. This one's, um, just makes me want to like cuddle with the person, <laughs> depending on who it is, obviously. Right. But wow, this is nice to like cuddle and fall asleep to. Mm -hmm. you know it's very, it's very like, it's a very, it gives fresh me, and cozy. it gives me trusting vibes. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, uh, I would want to cuddle up okay. with this fragrance if it was on. Like, so that's a really was, good thing. If it thing. was on like my boyfriend, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like I would, I would want to cuddle up like with if he was wearing this, you know. So scale of ten. Twelve. This is my favorite. Amazing. I think because I'm a huge cuddle person, and it just makes you want to like cuddle up and watch a movie or like you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, I like this one. Get it. I love it. So this, I love it. This is office for men. I love it. Yeah. I love it. I wouldn't say it's like necessarily, you know, maybe if you're on a first date, maybe not, you know, mm -hmm. but if you've been in a relationship or if, you know, you're in love and you're kind of like having a date night, like at your house or something and watching a movie, I would totally wear this. Like, or I would love to smell it on a guy. This is so comforting. Cool. So this so is. So it's not this. Okay. This what I'm is trying to say. long term boyfriend material. Yes. Long term boyfriend, not hoe materials. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Cool. Yes. I love it. This is my favorite. It's not particularly sexy. It's more like, I trust you. You're the love of my life. <laughs> so cool. What? I don't even know. Amazing. So, <laughs> Office for Men by Fragrance One or Jeremy Fragrance. Um, for those of you that one. know Jeremy Fragrance. Um, awesome. We'll be back on the dry downs. She's going to let us know if she likes it better, worse, or the same. I'm scared. <laughs> We're back on the dry downs. Chantal's going to let us know if she likes them better, worse, or the same. You ready? Sauvage Parfum. I like it better. Oh my God, I like it so much better. Okay. What did I give this one? A nine. How do you remember this? I, I remember some, I don't remember all. Wow. Well, I give a it a 10 now, because this is delicious. It, after a while, it settled in, it smells a little bit stronger. Well, we're going to have to rank these. <laughs> Preference order. I know. <laughs> I like like all of them. These are the most sold men's fragrances of all time in the perfume collection. So, I really edition. Like it. So, I like it. It smells better than. There's a reason why they're the most sold. Blue de Chanel perfume. This is the one that you would want to wear. And you give it an 11 out of 10. Wow, I don't like it anymore. Wow. How weird. Strange. Is it because I smelled other things? You've smelled a lot of things, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's just taste, when it settles down though, it changes a little bit. I don't like it anymore. So what would you score it right now? Like a four. Oh, you don't like it at all. I don't like it anymore. Wow. I don't know what happened. It went from a 12 out of 10 to a four. What happened? That's weird, but it changed. Yeah. Why did it change? It just settled. A lot of times when fragrances, once the dry down happens, you lose some of the top notes, which is the fresher notes usually. And some I of the darker notes like come it forward. Is that weird? Is my scent like completely? No, it's just your preference. We'll, we'll, I'll have you re-smell it again okay. in a second. That's, that's we'll go through all these and I'll have you smell I literally it give it like a four now or a five. Like, I don't... Me. Eros Parfum. This one smells better than before. Okay, because it was too strong initially. And it's settled. I yeah. love it. 
And we said we would go back and have you. It would I change. like this one. I like it a lot. So you gave it a I six before, to, I, I would believe. love to swan on a guy. I think I would give it now a, an eight. I would an give eight. it an eight. It went to an eight. I cool. like it a lot. So like, but still not in your top top three. Not, no. Uh, Gio Profumo or Gio. Super piney now. Yeah. Pine, like Christmas pine tree. Okay. That usually I comes like from it. the incense. It's really fresh. I and personally, I love the smell of pine mm -hmm. pine trees. So this is beautiful. It smells great. Very good winter scent. I like it. I, what did I give it last? I don't remember to be honest with you. I want to say eight out of ten. I would give it the same an eight. Cool, keep it Yeah, it doesn't smell better or worse. It smells just like really good. I like it. Cool. Here's Elixir, your <laughs> F boy fragrance that you loved. <laughs> I still love it. It gives me heavy pine tree now. Yeah. To me, I literally just smell pine and it's syrup. It's still F boy and I like it. I like it. I would still get it if you're a F boy. <laughs> and here is. One million parfum, your day at the beach. The day at the beach. The brought you childhood memories ah, of Barbie fragrance. It literally, oh my gosh, it gave me even more like Barbie oh fragrance. God. I could smell this all day because it was like a Barbie scent to me. Oh, if still beach, pool party, all the way. I would even wear it to the freaking beach, honestly. No. I love it. I would give it the same. It's so good. And your favorite. Office I'm for men. Scared. I don't want to not like it. It to me, it still smelled like office to me when I just smelled it. Ah, uh, yes, it just so comforting. Yeah. The same, literally the same. All right. I, I gave it a twelve, right? My yeah. favorite. Yeah. It is still my favorite. It's um long lasting relationship, um non f boy. So your favorite is this my first place? My favorite. I love it. I hate the bottle, but I love it. Edit that out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say that? I don't even know. I don't care. <laughs> um, now for second I place, let's have you debate between the Sauvages. You have Sauvage Parfum and Sauvage Elixir. Which one do you like better? So that's Elixir. That's elixir. Very nice. Oh, I like the Sauvage. The original. Mm -hmm. So that's your preference. So second place goes to Sauvage. Second place goes to Sauvage, for sure. I like the Sauvage second place. All right. So keep... It's just stronger and more like, I want to say like oily. Like, you know, I like it. Yeah. I like it. It's stronger. So for third place, hold that one. Oh. So she's sure. still got Elixir in her hand. Elixir versus Profumo. Just to, to even out the top. Perfumo. Perfumo. This one isn't really smelling very much anymore. Yeah. You know, it kind of, it faded a little bit. So. This one for sure. So third place, Perfumo. Yes. All right. Third place. Eros. Wait, no, we got third place. We gotta third keep, place. We're, we're placing elixir. Okay. Elixir <laughs> or Eros. Which one would you rather have on a guy? This one. Elixir. Yeah. Okay. So hold. Wait, uh, no. So now you get a whole parfum. <laughs> That's third place. Yes. Or fourth place. I'm gonna have you Blue de Chanel parfum. <sighs> All right. So we have Eros or Blue de Chanel parfum for fifth place. This one changed so much. Elixir. Eros. Cool. And then one million parfum. Wait, you... not elixir. Sorry, this one. Eros. 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 And then. I like this so much better. With between these two. Between those two. Okay. So it's she has in her left hand is blue de Chanel, and in her right hand is one million. One million. You just thought it was the beach scent, the parfum version. So. <laughs> It's crazy how much Blue de Chanel changed for you. It changed a lot. Yeah. 
See, but this one's tough because like this one I would wear for the beach only. Yeah. This one I would like to smell like on a super casual like whatever day. Yeah. You know what I mean? To like just hang out. Not you can tie them if you want. Just for the I would different tie occasions. Them. Different occasion, completely different scents. This one's screams like tan tanning lotion Ken. You know? Yeah. Like on Ken. Be you know how Barbie. Bart okay. Do y'all remember? I don't know if y'all play with Barbies or like Bratz, but you know how they s like some of them smelt like yeah. like tanning lotion, or they uh -huh. made them smell like a certain way. Like this is what Ken smelled like, like the beach Ken that I got when I was little. Cool. <laughs> anyway. And we have one little just little up. bonus thing we're adding to this video. Um, if you ever saw her reaction to Explorer by Mont Blanc, she was absolutely <laughs> obsessed with Explorer. I wonder if it I has a similar vibe to Aventus. Aventus came out first. Let everyone know if Aventus makes you go crazy like Explorer did. Uh, it's strong. She's a strong girl. That was just one spray. Damn. I would totally love to smell this on a guy. I'm thinking like dinner vibes, fancy yeah. dinner vibes. Yeah, I feel like it needs to be dressed up a little bit. It needs to be dressed up. Oh, like a guy in a suit with like a nice tie and like his hair is all like perfectly lit. But you still, you mess with this one then too. I really like it for like a night out. I would love to smell it like when I hug a guy or something. It's like, mmm, that's so nice. It's refreshing. And scale 10. 10. 10. 10. Man, this is there nice. we go. This is a good scent. I like it. 10 out of 10 for Aventus. We picked some good ones for you today, but these are the some of the highest sellers in the fragrance industry, yeah. so it makes sense that they all scored very well. They all scored but well. But now we have a preference order. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Thank you, Chantal. Be sure to follow us down below. Yes. Spotify. Yes. Spotify. Instagram yes. personal account. Instagram her business account, Sunshine Swim and all that jazz. Yay, yeah. thank you. Bye guys. Bye guys.